Good day, it's good to see you. In today's video, I'm gonna talk about the Neorhythm Omnipem. It's this, this device right here, it's in the mesh. When you take it out, here it is. It's this headband that you can wear. I'll put some, I'll play some cool B-roll. But this is something that you put on your head. You can put it in different ways. You can put it on forwards, backwards, and on your neck. I'm gonna talk about what I love about it, what I don't love about it, uh, what it's like using it, and who should buy this, who is this for, and who should not buy this. So stay tuned and uh, let's get into this, today's vlog. about this and what I think is interesting this is a PEMF device so pulse electromagnetic field device that you wear on your head and what it tries to do is create tiny electromagnetic waves that that are trying to synchronize your wave into a certain wave state so you have your alpha beta theta delta brain waves and what this will do is depending on the mood that you pick the goal is that this sends waves that try to uh, increase or decrease the wavelengths that you're aiming after. This will send waves to try to get you closer into those states, which is really cool. That I love, and they've done two double blind placebo tests where they say, you know, these are studies that they've run themselves, so I would always kind of be hesitant and maybe try to read these papers, but just double check and like make sure. They said that there's two features on here that really have driven impactful change in their placebo studies double blind placebo studies. And that I think was their enhanced mental capacity and deep relaxation modes. I'm gonna double check if I'm totally incorrect, I will list it down here. Um, but those two supposedly were the ones that worked. The rest of them, they didn't really run studies, so I'm not really sure if you can trust they work or not, even from their own studies. Um, but first, next, I'm gonna go into what it's like using it. But first, I need to work out. Okay, so essentially how this device works, the Neurorhythm by Omnipem. So to do that, this is how you wear it. You put it on either this way, I think this is the stimulation, the relaxation goes on the back of your head, and then there's a pain one that you can just wear like a backwards necklace too. And <clears throat> how it works is you have to tap it once, boom, and then you open up the app and it says connect. So you gotta tap the Neurorhythm once for it to activate, you tap connect on there. Once it's connected, that's where I can pick a mode. If you already have a mode that you just used, I can double tap and it'll go straight into that mode. So I just used it for the sleep one. Yeah, I just keep these on typically. The improved sleep, the eight hour option, that was my default mode and I would just use it only for that just to see if it would actually improve my sleep. I didn't really notice any big differences in my data. I think there's just larger factors outside of my life that I need to control first before this has the potential to uh, increase my HRV or things like that but there was not a huge impact. It has different modes, right? Enhanced mental capacity, I can pick the time. So what I do love about it is that it potentially could work. <laughs> um, and I'm not really sure, I, it personally didn't have a huge impact on me. So the, so the things that I don't really love about it <laughs> is that you have to uh, get your foundational aspects right. This is like the, if there's an, if you follow the 80-20 rule, this is the 20%, right? If this actually works, this device is meant for that extra 20% to get that extra 20, 10% addition to what you're already doing to be successful. So if you don't have a proper sleep schedule and you're trying to use the improved sleep feature on this, like you're way backwards. It's like you trying to wear a fast swimsuit uh, just because Olympians wear it, but you don't even know how to swim yet. Like you first need to perfect your stroke and then you put on the fast swimsuit. So this is kind of like that fast swimsuit. It's that last piece that can get you there. And I just noticed compared to the, the Apollo Neuro, which is somewhat of a similar device in terms of this is a 20% device. That one uses vibrations though, whereas this uses electromagnetic field waves. And the startup time and the effort it takes to get this one going is actually much harder. So you have to tap it once, get it ready, go open the app, tap connect, because it doesn't automatically connect, 
then it some for some reason it asks you the settings every single time. So I just hit next, and then I get to pick my type that I want to do, and then I get to pick the duration. Whereas the Apollo Neuro is really simple. It automatically connects, and then I can select which one I want to do, and the time is already preset to what I selected last time. So that's like two to three taps in the Apollo Neuro. Whereas this, right, you have connect, you have next, you have select program, and then you have the actual program, and then the time, that's five, and then finally select, and then it's ready to use. And now I have to double tap again the actual physical device itself to get it going. So that's kind of the piece where I was just not a huge fan of that entire flow of just getting the process going. Like that's a lot of effort just to use this. But it looks cool. So I do love, like look at this just the sleekness. It's white, it's got like this black fade to it. When you put it on the charger, it just sits nicely like this futuristic item that you just purchased and it just looks absolutely stunning. But just because something looks absolutely stunning doesn't mean it's good for you. So something to keep in mind. Um, but yeah, it's just, it's just sexy. It's a sexy looking device. Very well done in terms of the hardware design. Absolutely great. And it has the sleeve that you can put in when you're trying to do the improved sleep. So I put it underneath my pillow. Now the pieces that I didn't love about it is that I did not really feel the effects. I'm not really sure if this is actually working for me. They say it doesn't work for everyone. Great. Now who should buy this device? Look at this, this is the, this is the entire workflow and process right there. Um, I think someone who is trying to get that, it's the neurostimulation for better living. If you're trying to get that extra 20% and you already have succeeded, in the main foundational 80%, then yes, go for it. But don't be the person who thinks that this is gonna change your life automatically. Like, you need to put in the work. Stop being a lazy piece and get the work done. But this, I think I'm, gonna, I'm returning it. So I'm sending it back. Uh, just fun fact, they do allow a return policy, but you have to ship it back to Slovenia. So from the United States here, I'm using USPS. The other ones are like $200, $150. USPS is $60 almost from my location in Colorado to ship it to Slovenia. And that's just a lot of money to return an item. But I do this for the channel, I do this for you guys. So if you enjoyed watching this video, please subscribe, hit the like button down below, and just leave a comment. Comment for the algorithm, it helps support the growth of this channel. Buy more of these devices to kind of share with you. So I really appreciate it when you like, comment, it's so supportive, and like, thank you for watching the entire video through. I hope this was helpful. I hope this helped decide your purchase decision on getting the NeoRhythm OmniPem 80-20 rule. Follow the 80-20 rule. Something potentially worth trying, return it if it doesn't, but just be ready to pay the return shipping. My name is Sherman Shares. We share, we share products, experiences, and services that help you achieve your peak performance. I hope you enjoyed this video. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.